I saw an article recently about two men who had been incarcerated for the same crime. One man was rather wealthy and he was able to put together the bond to get out of jail and he sat in jail basically for two weeks before that happened. The other individual did not have financial resources and he was in jail two years before he was able to get out on bond, before trial was even uh, taken place, before it even happened. And that's a significant difference between two weeks and two years. If we're going to have accountability in our community, the community in which we live, we need equity, access, and advocacy. Without equity, what happens is some people are able to have the ability to uh, enjoy certain things that others aren't. And so what happens is this. In the justice system, you have some people sitting in jail for two years. They didn't do anything any worse than someone who got out after two months. Equity means that we all have access to a great education. Equity built into health care, meaning that everyone has access to a good quality health care. When you have inequity in our society, then we create pools of people that pull away from each other rather than pulling together. Accountability in the community means looking out for everyone. It means coming together and realizing there's something bigger than just me. And in doing that, you build equity, you build access, and you build advocacy. And when you're living that in the community, you're building an accountable community. An accountable community creates people who will contribute to that community. They contribute in the workforce. They contribute in the neighborhoods and when we get on that track then what happens is we're more productive we come together and we create a more accountable world if you'd like more information on accountability and accountability in your life your organization check out my website at iamaccountable.com leave us a thumbs up share the video I'll see you next time